Thank you for coming to KSHB.com and checking out the weather blog. Hoping you're having a great weekend. The weather is nice. There is no doubt about that. But it is getting dry. We had those grass fires on Friday. And we have not had measurable rain or snow in 17 days. That's through Friday. So today we'll make it 18. And Sunday we'll make it 19. So getting dry quickly. And let's get into some, some snowfall statistics. Our measurable snow days this year... We've had four of them, and we've had about four and a half inches of snow. Last year, we had 5.9 inches of snow and only nine snow days. The least snowy winter ever in 2011 and 12, we had 3.9 inches of snow and five measurable snow days. So, based on that, we probably have not seen our last snow day. Now, we're not going to get to any 12 or 18 like those big snowy winters from 2012 to 2015 or 2012 to 2014. 2015, we had like 14 inches of snow, which is below average. Just really light amounts the last couple of years. Here's another statistic. When was the date of the last measurable snow? Well, we have not had a measurable snow here since the 5th of January. Last year, last season, it was January 21st. 2014, 15, 2013, 14, it was March. And yes, that's not a misprint. In 2012, 2013, the last measurable snow day was in May. We had one to three inches of snow over a three-day period. It was crazy. And then 2011, 2012, it's February 4th. So when you look at the dates of the last snow, you look at the days of the last measurables of, the, of measurable snow, we have not seen our last snow. Like, there is no way winter comes to an end in Kansas City on the 5th of January. Uh, granted, there's not an in the forecast, but between the 25th of February and about March 10th or so, or 20th of February to March 10th, there's a chance for one or two snow situations. So, beautiful weather. Not going to have any snow with zero stratus clouds out there. The clouds may thicken up a little bit as we go through the day. The roads this morning were damp, not because it rained, but because Gulf moisture has moved in and the moisture on the pavement condensed because the ground was cold. And so, like a cold Coke can outside in the summer, it gets wet on the outside. And that's what happened to the roads. Temperatures starting off the day in the 40s and 50s. And today, we were thinking we would have a low overcast and thicker clouds and being only in the 50s. That is not going to be the case. Uh, now, not to say we won't have some low clouds around and the patches and some, some, period, some hours might be overcast, but overall, with a partly cloudy, occasionally mostly cloudy sky, into the 60s, 62 to 68 across the city, 68 in Lee Summit, 67 in Olathe, 72 in Clinton and Pleasant. It might even be warmer than that. So the less clouds we have today, the warmer it will get. And yes, we have this little surface load nearby, but the front is just not that strong as indicated by the air in Bismarck, North Dakota. It's close to 40 in sat on an afternoon in February. It's not that strong of a front. Look at Wichita Falls, 87, 83 in Oklahoma City. Near 90 down there. It is getting dry, not only here, but all the way down to Oklahoma and Texas. And there is a storm to watch here the next four to six days for some locations in this map, not for us. So let's kind of go through this. Overnight tonight and tomorrow, that service low will move by. We'll get into a northerly breeze. It'll pick up. So tomorrow morning will be around 40, breezy and cooler and dry. Oklahoma and Texas, mostly dry. There might be a shower in Oklahoma or Texas there. And then through the day tomorrow, periods of high clouds in the 40s for us, thickening overcast to the south. And as we go into Monday morning, starting to see some precipitation form in western Kansas down into Oklahoma and Texas. For us, it's just cloudy and dry. And Monday will be a cloudy day here, but a dry day. Look at that rain and snow taking over Oklahoma and Texas. Near 90 in southwest Oklahoma today. And by Monday, it could be snowing not that far from there. So pretty incredible. So 80s and Texas also, where it's going to be snowing on Monday. For us, we're on the northern fringe of this thing. We might get a sprinkle or maybe an ice pellet Monday night, but it is just not going to amount to much. So total rainfall, great news for Oklahoma and Texas in the winter wheat crop down there. One to three inches of rain for us, trace to a tenth the next seven days. And that may be pushing it because only Monday night might we see a few showers and that would be it. So the forecast for today is looking great up to 65 degrees on average here in Kansas City. A light northeast wind this evening if you're headed out. 
It'll cool off into the 50s and 40s. Grab a jacket. It will definitely, as the sun sets, turn cooler. And on the seven-day forecast, Valentine's Day, the weather's looking beautiful. 51 degrees on Tuesday and a partly cloudy sky. And back up to 60 by next weekend. So the winter just keeps rolling along without much winter. Have a great rest of your weekend.